What's good, YouTube? It's your main man, Carter, and I'm back with another video. I hope you all had a great weekend. And today, I'll be making some basic procedural water in Godot. So make sure you all like and subscribe for more great content. With all that being said, let's get right into the video. So I first loaded up a mesh instance and assigned it a shader material. Then you can assign it a color. Then you can load a normal map texture onto the normal map. And you can find these online or you can make your own in Blender. These are supposed to simulate bumps and dents. So for example, water has waves. You would use this to simulate the waves. Now the mesh doesn't have these bumps and waves, but thanks to the normal map, you can't tell. And this is a good way to save time on procedural water in your projects. And also you want to turn the normal map scale up to 16 or something so that you can actually make out the textures. And here I have it all the way up on 16 and then you can tweak with the other settings like metallics so that you can make it more reflective and you can change the mode to add to make it transparent and you can use the uv scale to replicate the texture i have done all these things for my procedural water but you can do something different for yours and that is the end of this video so make sure you all like and subscribe to my channel you can go ahead over to the shorts in the community section if you want to check me out more often and with all that being said have a great rest of your day and i'm out of here